That was the sound of Darian pissing everyone. <laughs> <laughs> a little treat, I guess. <laughs> Took the whole setup into the bathroom to briefly piss and then quickly raced back out here to the living room so that you all could have a, a fun little treat. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <sighs> yeah. You good? I'm doing good. You sure? I'm doing great. I don't know. Seems like you're not doing so hot. Uh, let's see here. What we got? What do you got? Oh God. You got something for me? No. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I'm worried. I was worried. No, we just got nothing. We got. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. D- DC put out a one shot comic this week. Oh yeah. Which is you know how comic books are weird and like they'll be labeled the month after they come out mm-hmm. like the april issue comes out in, in march. march right so you know they they did so the they did a one shot april special oh and let me pull it up oh yeah cuz uh boy <laughs> boy DC comics hyphen is this what i have to is this the oh no oh it auto corrected it oh no we hate that just accept my spelling mistakes and like let's move on yeah you know okay so they're calling it the april special okay (laughs) Mm, monkey (laughs) We return to monkey. We return to monkey. Mm, monkey. So uh, Mala got a bunch of the other ape gorilla villains to team up to do something, and it so happened that Sam, the gorilla detective, uh-huh. and Detective Chimp happened to be around and involved in like the thing that Mala was doing. Didn't you predict this? I well, I always go. I want more things with the DC gorillas. Right. Because there's so many. It, I need more content with these lads. It feels like you predicted this almost specifically, though. <laughs> like, we talked about it some time ago. Yeah, even the monkey that hangs out with the super, with, with the, the Wonder Twins. Yeah. Right here, yeah. And is that just like, is that that superhero that's Sung Wukong that's like new? Yeah, yeah, DC kind of forgot. About he that guy. Existed. What What does he go by? Monkey Prince. Just Monkey Prince? Yeah. Okay. I guess Monkey King was a little too on the nose. Well, he doesn't want to be compared to Sun Wukong. I see. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. But like, he inevitably will. It's, it's just, just gonna, like it's just gonna happen. Like, yeah. Because yeah. people will be like, are you the Monkey King? He's like, no, I'm no, the Monkey, monkey Prince. Prince. Fuck you, punches you in the mouth. Yeah. This is such a good team. Right. I like this a lot. They called themselves the... <laughs> uh the jla uh-huh. the jungle league of america that's so good <laughs> fuck that's so good dude oh my god i love that it was uh it was very good you should I do had, a live um, reading of that on stream no yes that'd be so fun no i had a good time reading it uh-huh it's the one shot special everyone i if if you like the monkeys of DC, of DC. comics, all it's a two fun of you all in the you. in the audience, Ultra Humanites, there, I I like him. He's I like cool. I'm I'm more of a Mala man, truthfully. Oh, like Mala is like my favorite, but I don't like what they've done with Mala. Really? The past year. Well, because he he broke up with Brain. That's not Mala. Yeah. Well, it's it's one of those things of like. DC wanted the spice up things, and so they're like, "Well, let's just not have them be a couple." And I'm like, "Well, they had to well, break why up don't a gay you?" Couple, yeah, I'm like, they? "Did you really have to break up like one of the only gay couples in the villain lineup?" Like, period. Come on, and like iconic, Brain yeah. and Mala, I- literally iconic. Mm-hmm. That's relationship goals. It is, uh, and I guess was. I guess get you a man who is a brain in a jar. <laughs> And also one who is a giant monkey. <laughs> who is mm, monkey. We oog. And they just fell in love. And that's amazing. That, that's amazing. <laughs> that's amazing. Uh, 
Yeah. Uh, yeah, when they did that, I stopped reading Doom Patrol. I was just like, when I read that issue, I'm like, yeah, um, call me when they get back together. Yeah, and they actually. still haven't gotten back together. It's been, like year. Oh, it's been like year? a year. Oh, a year. Yeah. Sheesh. So I'm just like, heck, this actually. I don't know. Yeah, let's let's not do that anymore. And of course, like Ultra Human, just doesn't show up that often, despite the fact that like he should because he's a fun villain yeah that's great uh, i've always loved that ultra humanite is just like i need a good perfect body to house my amazing intellect uh mutated i mutated a gorilla body to just be even larger mm. a little bit just a little bit larger I and he put his brain in there and he's like ah oh, this body's perfect for me perfect. and i'm like what kind of person do you have to be like i would be that person yeah I'd be okay with that <laughs> It makes me think of like the fucking um, the one She Hulk uh, villain mm -hmm. squad where they replace their bodies, like their body parts and shit. Yeah. Like, because the, the main dude is just man head on, I'm pretty sure on monkey body is, I think, what he did, right? Yeah. I can't remember what he's called, but man, they just love doing stuff with monkeys, huh? Yeah, well, it, it sells. It put does. monkey on a cover, people are going to buy people it. People are going to buy it. People yeah. love monkey. You can lie to yourself, but people love you. People love, love monkey. monkey. Yeah, don't lie, guys. You it, love it's it. It's like how you know the obvious arch nemesis for the Flash, monkey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, obviously. <laughs> Duh. Monkey. Like you would assume it would be like Professor Zoom or the Reverse Flash. No, it's fucking no. Gorilla Grodd. Gorilla Grodd. <laughs> Fuck it. It's monkey. Monkey. <laughs> sorry, I, I'm sorry if you guys can't see the. The logic, you know, right, right. Oh, and Grodd go. wasn't in the special because he recently just got captured in the Flash comics, so he's in jail right now. Lame. Which they do mention, right? Because uh, they're like, "Where's Grodd?" And it's like, "Oh, he's in jail right now." Yeah. It cuts to him in jail and then cuts back. I like that. <laughs> I like that. That's pretty good. It's like, oh, he got caught by the Flash last week. Like, <laughs> shit. Nah, we don't need him anyway. Fuck it. Right. Mala's here. Yeah, Mala's like, oh, well, I'm the the superior. He's the uh, alpha. You might say. Ape here, so whatever. Whatever. He's in a tank top in this issue. That's bold. I know. <laughs> Is he wearing just a tank top? Yeah, I don't have pants on him. That's He's a monkey. <laughs> not gonna pants on him. He's a monkey. Monkey. <laughs> We need to know how many times did we say monkey in, the, <laughs> in this episode so far? Because I'm curious. It's what the people want. It's what the people want. It's, what... mm. it's just such a good word to say. Monkey. Mm. Monkey. It's, it's not right. It's, it's no. Right. It's not. Because DC stopped, what, I feel like once we hit the new 52, DC was like, we can't use our more outlandish characters anymore. It's so And so lame, a, lot of the, a lot of the fur bait characters like immediately fell off. And I'm like, but I liked those characters. I jerk off to that. I mean, uh, <laughs> I mean, I, I feel like there might be more of a market for them now, but are they ever going to bring them like probably really not. back? Well, because they're not going to be in the movies. So, and you know, there's that that's, issue, That's right? the benchmark it's, these days. Yeah, they're not going to. You get your go watch Planet of the Apes if you want like a, a monkey movie, you know. Yeah, yeah. So it's just I sometimes see porn of that monkey on my timeline. That's what Caesar. I yeah. think is what his name is. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He's pretty cute. I do like that guy. Mm -hmm. My um, I was I watched the uh, there was it was one of the Planet of the Apes movies where the two travel back in time to where people are still alive. Mm-hmm. And like they talk and you know they're wearing the masks and they're they're it's it's of the time it was in the seventies I can't remember which one which movie that was they have a baby, um, but then I think they all end up like dying. Sure, <laughs> it's a good movie. I I do I do love the names of the Planet of the Apes movies. Oh Seeing, yeah, seeing like the rise of the dawn of the planet of the. <laughs> it's so good. Of the shadow of the, the of the shadow, yeah. And then they, they then they start just looking like the modern Tomb Raider titles. Yeah, and rise of the shadow of the Tomb Raider. <laughs> I can't wait till we get the Planet of the Tomb Raider. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> that's what I'm waiting for. Uh, like actually, <laughs> like it would absolutely. I could see them just. Off the wall, sending her into space. 
Like she's going to the moon because they discovered like a, a temple of some kind on the moon. And they're like, well, who can we trust to raid this tomb? <laughs> and then the music plays. And- you see the pickaxe. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Man, they fucking did Laura from Dirty as fuck. Well, yeah, her breasts aren't as triangle anymore. Uh, <laughs> That's what people wanted. I like her. I like her reboot design though. I think she's really cute. It's like fine. She got a cute face. But I, like, I also look at this girl and I'm like, she wouldn't cross over with Witchblade. So what's the point? Oh my god! <laughs> Is that the benchmark of a Lara Croft? <laughs> Put her in the Witchblade armor. Does she look right? If well, because yes. they, they had a comic crossover. Right, right. <laughs> so I'm just like, this, I want this. <laughs> oh my god. I need a video game, a co-op action of... RPG where you play as Witchblade Girl and Laura, Laura Croft. Croft. <laughs> that would be pretty whack. Actually. You know you'd buy it. Shut up. Stop being right. Yeah. Speaking yeah. of things, I think um, last time I looked, I don't know if the sale is still going on now, but on PlayStation, the um, Senran Kagra X Neptunia was on sale oh. for like pretty cheap last I looked, but I don't know if it's you on can't sale tell anymore. Me that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well we 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 escaped the basement. Yeah, <laughs> we we had a moment with Mister Alfred. Yeah. And now we're like, can we get the fuck out of here, please? Yeah, yeah, he he was acting a little bit weird. He was acting a fool. That's fine. It already feels easier to breathe once we get into the hallway. When we pass through the living room, Murdoch's grandmother is gone. Is she gonna be okay? Don't ask me. I really wanted him to say who. Yeah. <laughs> who? <laughs> <laughs> she was Grandma Rowan. She's been dead for 40 years. <laughs> That's what How I How do you know that name? <laughs> she usually is. Oh, okay. We walk downtown. And it, now, the walk downtown is made a little trickier with the heavy silverware set I'm holding. For a summer morning, it's still very hot. I'm going to have to hose myself down before we're dressed if I want to be fresh. Ah. Background. Nice, Sue. New background. Big music. Oh, big music. <laughs> it's happening. As we approach the venue, I can't help but feel impressed. It's the most packed I've ever seen in a church in Echo. Well, at least a church site. Uh, the temple next uh, next door looks as neatly, nearly empty as always. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's, what, it's what weddings look like, Josh. And they are on a ver- That's a veranda. That's a veranda. That's a veranda ass veranda. Yeah, okay. Okay. This is what I, I picture, but I usually picture this on a boat. I know it can't because of how uh, the definition is worded, but I always think of like. Think of a veranda specifically being on a boat? Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. <laughs> I don't know why. Boats can have balconies, but they can't have verandas. They cannot. No, no, no. You no, build no. it right at where the where it touches right the water. At sea level. <laughs> That's what you want. That's fair. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Turns out veranda is just a fancy word for a porch. <laughs> we could have just waited. We could have just <laughs> waited. Dab. <laughs> <laughs> I see Murdoch sisters. His mother and his grandmother fussing about, along with some other laborers and a help, a handful of elder women I've never seen before. Everyone looks stressed out, is still putting on the last touches on everything. Oh, she's got a cute little outfit. Okay. Hey, Gretch. She she cleans up, I guess. I think it's cute. That's fine. Oh, good. We finally have the utensils. Murdoch's mother stalks towards me in maybe the most expensive outfit I've ever seen. Samuel. You gotta have tempered expectations of the time. <laughs> it's the t- of the times, man. She's also wearing a lot of pearls. I can't wait for it to get hooked around the gun when she gets, when shot, she gets shot. So that we get the shot of the pearls. <laughs> 
the literal <laughs> dumbest thing in the world. That shot looks dumber with every new Batman ad like film adaptation. Like, <laughs> I can't wait for it to like be a breakdance battle, and the guy shoots and does like a backflip, and his foot hooks the pearls and pulls them off her neck. It's gonna be great. <sighs> And here I thought uh, we were going to tell the guests that we'd be using uh, the pine cones. I shift a bit. Um, where do you want me to put uh, to put it down? She shakes her head, looking over me doubtfully. <laughs> Press X to doubt. <laughs> Just to give it to the caterers. There is no party without our heavy labor. But, to make the party, it calls for a much more delicate touch. The uh, sure. Where are they? <laughs> Morning, Samuel. Um, oh, I guess she's working with that. Yeah. She's like, the only other woman. <laughs> a was, woman! <laughs> I was gonna be like, why is she here? Who does she know? <laughs> I've been just saying that a lot in my day-to-day -day life, just like, a woman! A woman? <laughs> That's pretty good, actually. <laughs> it's pretty good. Oh. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, hi there. Uh, Murdoch makes another... Wait, Mother makes a grand gesture with her hand to Cynthia, and then walks away, heels clicking quickly as she moves. So, uh, what are you doing here? Who else is going to cater fine dining in Echo? The Silver Dollar. She lets out a loud laugh. Why pay for these silver exp experience when you can afford the gold? Ooh. Is, uh, is that the line you give people at the bar? <laughs> it could be. Besides, Echo's full, Echo's whole suffragette party was invented to, what, invited? Invited, whole, su okay, was invited to attend. What? Uh, that party who hates men? Cynthia's composure falls and she almost, <laughs> and she almost does a full body recoil. Uh, Nande! <laughs> Sam. Don't let anybody let a uh, hear uh, here let you say. S I'm having this, the words are falling apart. Yeah. Uh, don't let anybody here let you say something so stupid, or they'll throw your ass flat out. Well, I I don't really know what they're about. I try to get uh, I try not to get too involved in government. <laughs> they're the right. <laughs> they're the right to vote party, Sam. No. She crosses her arms. Do you even know what that means? <laughs> Do you know what voting is? I don't think Sam does. Yeah. Well, uh, I, su I support that. <laughs> uh-huh. I feel my cheeks getting redder. <laughs> I bet it's more complicated than that, but I don't want to look any more stupid today than I already do. This is, uh, I'm an ally. Oh, Sammy boy. Just say you don't understand it. Go and, off, uh, girl boss, on. pussy queen. <laughs> Shit, I just ripped a whole ton of skin off my phone. Yeah? That sucks. You collecting it? No. <laughs> I'm gonna go get, uh, go, uh, help get things ready. No, I've got stuff to do. Bye. <laughs> I feel, uh, I can feel her eyes on my back as she stares me down. That was a good exchange. Yeah, yeah. That was the good thing <laughs> about churches is that you can always depend upon them to be empty. Pew pew. <laughs> it's just so dumb. What do you mean? It's just so dumb. What do you mean? Absolutely dumb. That's my best material. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> My condolences. I still love the image oh. of like Princess Leia with a gun shooting, shooting and it just and shoots out pews. pews. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty good actually. That's that's one of my favorite images. 
It's, it, it aligns so <laughs> so perfectly with your sensibilities. So I mm-hmm, understand. Mm-hmm. Man, so I didn't really pick up that new Star Wars card game. Yeah. But I did buy play sets of the entire Rebels cast. <laughs> Oh my god! Because they were printed in set one, and I'm like, so, no shot. Yeah, <laughs> scoop, 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 scoop. And they were like all printed as common. <laughs> so, so they weren't too expensive to pick up. Yeah, they're inexpensive and don't function as a deck. So, you, so. You're like, this is just for me, yeah, literally yeah, just for me. Yeah. Is it like unique artwork or is it like shots from the? Oh, show? it's actually all unique artwork. That's awesome. Yeah, 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 I haven't seen a single thing about this Star Wars card game. Yeah, yeah. If you like, find it in the stores. That's maybe worth a pick up. Just okay. Like, if you find like a starter deck, okay, it's neat but not like amazing. Hmm. I would have known if I was if I if I had known it was a thing. I would have looked for it while I was at Walmart. Ah, oh, well, you know, Next or time. well, at least mostly empty. There's a pew near the front. Ah, uh. we're all the gang's all here. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt the sad breakfast club. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fuck. <laughs> I need Samuel to walk up and say that. Oh, my God. <laughs> you just need to commit to memory every single line that Cheryl has ever said <laughs> and speak only in Cheryl quotes <laughs> for the rest of your life. I, I can't wait in like five years when we get to the Lord of the Bees scene. Because I feel like when I saw that scene, I was like, Darian, we have to watch <laughs> Riverdale. I need to know. I didn't know who that girl was. And now you do. Now I Now know. it all makes sense, yeah, right? Yeah, now I'm like, yes, queen. I'm, <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. It's going to take some time, <laughs> but I am fucking looking forward to it. Holly and Jim are sitting there in silence, dressed in their wedding clothes. Murdoch sits in the middle, a head bowed, a posture bent over Mm -hmm. like one in prayer. Uh, But to who or for what, I wouldn't know. Uh, Don't y'all know it's bad luck for the bride and groom to see one another on their wedding day? They don't look like they're talking, but uh, none of them are looking at the altar either. Uh, like colon, colon. Uh, like they're too uncomfortable to look at it. That's a semicolon. That's a semicolon. No, oh, there you go. See, oh see my the god. <laughs> That's a semicolon. You can have a colon or a semicolon. Yeah, it's semi right now. Yeah, yeah. Is it like half a colon? Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I don't know what a colon looks like. It's just two dots. No, no. I mean like a colon. Like in the body, yeah. Oh, um, stomach. <laughs> Colon. What is it? What does it look like? Is it like between? Is it just like a little lump of flesh? I think so. The colon, or no, the colon is. I think the col is the colon the combination of your the combination word for your large and small intestine. Because I thought the colon is where you like get all the poopy out of you. No. Oh. I don't know how any of that works. I'm gonna look up. A, I'm gonna look up colon. Yeah. Colon. Let's see. Colon. Yeah. Um. Fuck. <laughs> There's so much going on. <laughs> that was a whole ass paragraph. Yeah. It's it's, it's, it's giving you the other. Oh, it's giving me the definition of the punctuation for colon. <laughs> Let's <laughs> go. Not the organ. <laughs> Uh, this is what we want this is what we're here for okay yeah the colon is like okay yeah it goes up yeah it goes through your intestines and then there's the colon brings it up and then down to your poop chute <laughs> that's yeah. what they call that yeah that's the, the science shoot. that's the science term the yeah, poop chute yeah. <laughs> we're not looking at one another a church is a place for thinking not speaking what are you doing now bitch she doesn't elaborate Murdoch stands up and looks to his sister I look forward to lighter thoughts once this day is through he stands looks at me and smiles then he uh, holds out an elbow for me what are you doing just getting in some practice He hooks his elbow with mine and walks me up the aisle on the opposite side of the altar, uh, toward the dark-stained glass doors of the entrance. We're supposed to go to the, um, go the opposite way. He shuts me up with a kiss. Nice. 
I feel tongue and I try to panic. I try not to panic. But Jim and Holly can't see us from here and there's nobody near the entrance. He pushes away with a small smack. Hmm, what was that for? It's just the reminder I needed that I'm not single at a wedding day. <laughs> You're so needy. <laughs> he nods. That's right. Speaking of needy, I'm going to need you to put on the formal wear you forgot at the apartment. <laughs> oh, right. Whoops. I did forget to bring it. Thanks. Thank Ralph. Thanks, Rat. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Rat. <laughs> Thanks, Rat. <laughs> rat doll. Rat. <laughs> We really treat him with zero respect. It's so good. The way though. it should be. Yeah, I love it. You really ought to freshen up before you uh, put the formal wear. Yeah, before you put the formal wear. Okay, through. Though, hmm, that was the plan. Here, there's a bathroom we can uh, fix you up in. I feel a small yelp escape me as he practically drags me into the bathroom. Dog doing okay? I think it's just air escaping from her belly. Okay. She was what? <laughs> Very good. We're in the uh, stinkiest desert. I don't want anybody going to complain too much about the inevitability of body odor. It sounds like an excuse to me. <laughs> Foxes smell worse than mountain lions, you realize. That just means we have to try harder. He brushes his cheeks against my uh, muzzle and slips his tail around my leg. Uh, the crisp smell of citrus blends with the uh, a slightly sweet and skunky smell of fox, along with a creamy, clean shaving cream. What a shaving shave. cream. What did he shave? Well, it's probably just you know, keeping things just clean. Just keeping it trimmed, trimmed and even, I suppose. Yeah, yeah. They don't yes. They don't want to be like Chunter, right? Yeah. No. <laughs> Gotta keep that shit out of here. <laughs> Gotta get that shit gone, dude. Oh... Uh... We love and respect Chunter in this household. Do we? I do. Okay. I can respect him. I don't know if I love him. He's kind of a little fucked up. You wouldn't, uh, you wouldn't choke him a little bit? Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit? Maybe a little bit. No. That's a treat. That's a treat. A little choking is a treat, you know? <laughs> like bring that little neck over here, Chunty baby. Right? My little Chunty. <laughs> Uh, he scrubs me down with a wet bar of soap and splashes me with water, letting the suit hang neatly on the door. This is stupid and ridiculous. <laughs> well, well fit for a house of God. <laughs> Frankly, I think he'd be... He'd capitalize? Okay. Uh, be less offended if we committed acts of... Obsca Obscenity. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Obscenity. Yeah, but the H is he is in capital God he. He. His name is he? Well, he's referring to God as he. <laughs> so he would have to capitalize the H with that one. Would you? Yes. <laughs> Fine. Rolls are stupid. <laughs> I'm more uh, scared of what my mother would do if she caught us than God. Don't even joke about that. Who says I'm joking? After even after enough scrubbing, splashing, and sniff testing, he finally deemed me appropriate to put on the suit. That was just an excuse for him to smell you. Period. Like, he loved that. Yeah. He's like, let me get in that pit, dude. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> terrible. He did terrible. The <laughs> <laughs> he folded in aisles. Yeah. <laughs> Just real quick and subtle. I think a whiff, if you will. <laughs> this shit's so funny. It was very good. Just uh, real subtle. No attention called to it. He just... Yeah. Uh, then he dabbed uh, some sort of oil from the bottle by my wrist. And my ears that made me smell like a campfire. It just makes it worse that the word dabbed is actually there. <laughs> So it's like, you know, just went, uh. so dumb. <laughs> Let's not use too much. Remember, this is a wedding, not a funeral pyre. Pyre was a cool game. It's like basketball. 
<laughs> Pyre, like basketball. <laughs> yeah. You're not wrong. It is a good game. That, the game from that one studio that no one played. I don't know. A lot of people played Hades. People only played Hades. <laughs> I think retroactively more people played Bastion. I feel like that game's actively now too old. It, it, it is now, but it wasn't like five years ago. Hades isn't that old. No, no, no. Bastion. Yeah. Bastion. Well, that's what I mean. Is like, I don't think that would have brought people up. Uh, I mean, no one plays the one that I like the most, so it's fine. <laughs> Which one is that? Is it your fucking background on your computer? I don't know what you're talking about. You have no proof. No proof. I could easily, like, swap no proof. the, <laughs> swap the uh, recording display don't to your that. fucking desktop. Don't do that. I don't. Well, I don't think I have anything sensitive on my desktop, but also don't do that. We don't need to do it's that. It's fine. It's, it's fine. fine. He smiles as he fixes my tie and finishes my cufflinks. Now, I still have some things to take care of, so please lend a hand where it's needed, and let's keep a professional distance throughout the ceremony. He resists, yeah, he rests his hands on my shoulders, his smile falters a bit, and then he brings me in for a much tighter hug with his face buried in my chest. Let's make the best of this day. Unpleasantries aside, he opens the door and slides out quickly, of footsteps fading as he walks away. I look in the mirror and make sure I'm as presentable as he wants me to be. Then I step out of the door. Swing. I look down the pew and see that Jim and Holly aren't at the front. Jim isn't in the chapel at all. Holly is sitting at the pew closest to the bathroom, near both of the only exits in the chapel. I try to walk past with her back to me, but she speaks. You're quite close to my brother, aren't you? As close as any shopkeeper, <clears throat> shopkeeper can be with his employee, ma'am. Quite. She turns her head around to look at me. Yet it's clear that you aren't merely a shopkeeper, nor a servant. How much is he paying you? I don't disclose my paycheck, ma'am. She purses her lips and opens her pocketbook. She takes out a thin slip of paper. So this is a blank check. Write the amount you'd like me to pay you to quit today. Lit. Damn. <laughs> no, no, Holly. That's a power. That's move. pretty strong. <laughs> Holly's just like, I gotta get this bitch out of here. Uh, I mean, unironically, I would take the offer. Yeah. Yeah, I would quit being a shopkeeper. And then Murdoch can still pay me for other services. Fair enough. This is just for this job. Yeah, because she only really knows about this. Yeah, so like, this seems like this could be the winnest of wins. I I, I could see it, however... Sam is not that Samuel ha Well, Samuel has an emotionally vested interest in Murdoch now. And the job is a way of him being around Murdoch more frequently. In a, in a daylight space, if you will. Eh. You know, men, eh. men can't just hang out in the daytime. Oh, that's what Ralph is for. It's true. However. Yeah. However. However. I don't have the time or the energy to be civil today, so I'd... So I'd to just, the like, like, be done with this. I'd to just, like... <laughs> yeah, I think that's a little... I think it's a little, a little wibbly. That's not you. Okay. That's the text. <laughs> I don't think that's correct. Or is I, this how they talked back then? It could be. Could be. I'm no expert. <laughs> but it just don't seem right to me. No, ma'am. At this point, I don't think you could afford uh, to send me home. Just write the number. <laughs> she hands me a pen and I take it. I write $500 in the empty space. She takes a look at the check. No, that's quite doable. <laughs> oh my god. Let's go. <laughs> He should have put another zero. Yeah, lame. But I, uh, you know, five hundred is like crazy money for this time. Oh yeah, like that's oh, not yeah. insignificant yeah, yeah, for this yeah, time yeah, period. Yeah. Is it? Huh? I should have made the number higher to get the point across. Oh my god. 
I take the pen back and write two zeros after. Then I give her the pen back. Amazing. Okay, so you're not actually interested in money. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Crosses out one zero. <laughs> How's that? How you like that? Hmm? It's like, yeah, I won't work for you, but I'll just hang out. Uh, suspicious for an ordinary shopkeeper, considering that's the point of why you work. So what exactly are you working for? I don't have a great retort to that. Loyalty. I see doubt cloud her eyes and her brow furrow. If we weren't in a church, she'd probably shout faggot at any moment. But I, but I can tell that she's not looking for a fight yet. So, you're genuine. Wait, genuine? Yes, mm -hmm. to my brother then. Good for him, and good for you. But do you really think staying in this town would be good for him? The opportunity that Jim can open up for us are the best thing that could happen to us right now. I can feel that we're running out of time. So they would all move. So Jim and Holly would leave and take Murdoch with them so that Murdoch could just like fuck Jim whenever. Yeah. Interesting. I assume the... I, I thought the plan was like for the family. Oh, for to move. oh yeah, they were gonna move the whole family. Yeah. I'm a fool. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot that. I thought it was just like, damn, you just bring in Murdoch along to hoe to Jim. That's yeah. crazy. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, yeah. Because it happened before. The miasma and its effect upon the city are well documented in the town hall. In the town hall. Okay. Effects such as migraines, shared dreams, hallucinations, escalated acts of violence. All the men who died left bones and grave markers behind where it was started, where it was stated they were buried. Reading a tall tale is one thing. Living through an act of provid providence is another. Garden. Uh, not Satan, you think? Maybe we do have something in common. God made Satan, you fool. <laughs> he is the end and the beginning. We would be fools to stay here, just like the men of Sodom and Gomorrah. Then maybe he'll leave. Not a chance. That damn rat has him locked into place here. Huh. I didn't expect her to say that. Ralph wants to leave Echo too. She lets out a quick and concerning shriek of laughter. And lose his honeypot. Dog. Beanball. Very good. His business is good here. So good that he has my brother hooked on his drugs too. The last thing he'd ever want to do is leave. That's been a lot less prevalent than I thought it was going to be. There's a drug ring? Yeah. Well, the, just the drugs in general. Because considering, like, a lot of the times we ran into Murdoch, uh, Murdoch in the other routes, he was, like, like, like think of, like, like Nick's route. Yeah, it was or, all loopy. He was, like, mega zooted. Yeah. He was, like, super zooted. Not just, like, normal wowed. Yeah. But, like... Very uh, whelmed. Yeah. Very whelmed. Over, even, somewhat. <laughs> However. But, you know, I mean, I'm fine with it not being i mean it, we've had things going on you know he doesn't need to be drugging up all the time mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so it's fine it's fine certainly not before it's too late anyway at this point i can't tell if one of them is lying to me or if they just both genuinely misunderstand one another this goes deeper it might have started on it started on the day their brother died maybe even before that why isn't your mother concerned? Because she's stubborn and faithless. She's not nearly as close to God as she claims, and everybody knows. Damn. But they don't care because she gets things done. Holly calling her mom a fake God fan. That sucks. <laughs> fake fan. Checkmate, atheist. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> God damn. 
<laughs> that's pretty good. I mean, that's one of my favorite It's things. really funny. <laughs> it's just funny to say, checkmate atheists. Yeah. <laughs> it's best when you say it, like, relating to just... Literally anything. Literally anything. <laughs> Uh, that won't matter when there's a reckoning. If you can manage to find him, yeah, to for help him find a way out, then you won't have an enemy in me. If you interfere, if you interfere with my own survival plans, you will find my ire potent. She stands and looks me over once more. Now, if you please, my family is expecting my appearance. I wasn't holding you back, lady. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> she turns away and disappears behind a sliding wooden door. What a catch she is. I hear Jim's voice, but don't see him. Until I realize that he's sitting on the floor against the wall, smoking a cigarette. <laughs> pathetic. This <laughs> pathetic puddle bitch of a man. Absolutely incredible. Would you look down at him like Oscar did? Shinji to pathetic. pathetic. Absolutely. It's <laughs> uh, one of my favorite frames. That's really good. <laughs> pathetic. It's very good. Very, very good. Oh, he's a little bottom bitchy boy. <laughs> he's just sitting there smoking his little cigarette. Uh, you shouldn't be smoking in a church. And you shouldn't be swallowing my seed. Funny how the scruples based on lunacy wash over us. He flicks a bit of ash on the carpet. Relax. I won't burn us all down. Much as I'd like to. He chuckles bitterly and then goes back to smoking. So, what did you make of Holly's speech? About God? He looks at me incredulously. Who the hell knows? She could be making up all the folklore and crystal nonsense for some other aim of hers. The minds are weird, though. I feel the soreness in my head throb. Weird how? The irregular layouts that seem like they should promote cave instability, but they're stable. Copious numbers of carbon monoxide pockets without a clear source of emissions. <laughs> I thought it said copium for a moment. Copium. <laughs> you know, they're always huffing copium down there in the fucking mine, thinking their life's going to get better. Yeah. <laughs> Jim would say copium. He would. <laughs> Saying, oh, my life's, uh, my life's so hard. Copium. <laughs> what are you doing? Cookie. What are you doing, little doggles? What are you doing, bib? Are you just are you all just waiting in line to get pet? Is that how this works? Pretty much. <laughs> one dog lines up, the others show up, you pet one, they go, yeah, I've had enough, walks away, the next one walks up. Yeah. <laughs> A little bit. God, su subscribe to the fast pass system. Come on, dogs. <laughs> I know it's um is it Genie Pass now? Is that what it's called? I think that's done as well. Is it really? I Damn. Don't know. They make new like apps like every other year. Ah, I don't know. I don't know how all this works. Traces of gold that should be l that should lead to a logical vein, but which do not. And more quartz than you would care to see, though that's not unusual by any means. I wanted the dog to take a drink. No, just, <laughs> just grab, just grab, grab the, the soda can. Grab the can and go. Ah, 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 yeah, and that's what I was down. hoping for. <laughs> Quartz is the most abundant mineral in the crust of the planet. I wouldn't be giving these ideas a thought if not for the delirium it's caught casting on Holly. Oh, she's genuinely scared. I don't take acknowledgement of that for, as forgiveness or concern. She's crossed a line with me that she can't uncross. Are you still going through the marriage then? Oh, are you still going through? Ah, don't. Is there any other recourse? Two of the three sets of photos have been destroyed. He nods. That's half. 
which makes it worthless. Even if you go through with the wedding ceremony, you don't have to make it legal. <laughs> there, there would still be time. As long as you still go through with the ceremony. He gives me an impatient um, look. I'm here, aren't I? What nags you all are. Because clearly you don't need any help. Don't patronize me. <laughs> You're getting things out of this performance, too. Only things I want is Holly's brother out of y'all's mess. A mess he contributed to, as you so wisely reminded me of yesterday. Should we rejoin the party then, groom? I hold out my hand to him and beckon impatiently. He gives it a look and look like it's a soiled rag. But he takes it and lifts, uh, and lifts himself to his feet. Okay, I think we'll end the part here. Okie dokie. So we'll see you guys around! <laughs>